Good morning. Good morning. Welcome back to Coffee in the Word. Grace and peace to you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. I hope and pray that you're doing well this morning. It's hot. Mm. Oh, but it was those insulated uh, travel mugs and, and uh, it's a little hot. I'll let that cool. <laughs> All right, well, you know what? It's been a while since I've done this um, uh, uh, introduction. Is due. Uh, my name is John Guru, and I am from Joy Lutheran Church in Richmond, Texas. And uh, every morning I get up and I, I read from the Revised Common Lectionary. Um, and if you look on the description of this video, you can see where I get the readings from, and you can subscribe to the same thing. Uh, and I put it on my iPad so I can read it. And uh, so anyway, that's that's what I do. I started doing this back in the pandemic and it's going on it's a little over four years now. I get up every morning and I do miss a morning here and there for you know technical difficulties or if I'm sick or traveling or something like that. But for the most part, I'm here every morning. So uh, I enjoy it. So this morning we're going to start off in Psalm 20 and then we have a reading in Numbers. Have, have not been to Numbers in a while. And then we're going to the Gospel of Mark. So Psalm 20. And as always, may God bless the reading of his word. May the Lord answer you in the day of trouble. May the name of the God of Jacob protect you. May he send you help from the sanctuary and give you support from Zion. May he remember all your offerings and regard with favor your burnt sacrifices. Selah. May he grant your heart's desire and fulfill all your plans. May we shout for joy over your salvation and in the name of our God set up our banners. May the Lord fulfill all your petitions. Now I know that the Lord saves his anointed. He will answer him from his holy heaven. With the saving might of his right hand, some trust in chariots and some in horses, but we trust in the name of the Lord our God. They collapse and fall, but we rise and stand upright. O Lord, save the king. May he answer us when we call. Love that. All right. Uh, numbers. It's a short one this morning. It's Numbers chapter 6, verses 22 through 27. And this one is entitled Aaron's Blessing. The Lord spoke to Moses, saying, Speak to Aaron and his sons, saying, Thus you shall bless the people of Israel. You shall say to them, The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you, and give you peace. So shall they put my name upon the people of Israel, and I will bless them. That's uh love hearing that at the end of every service on Sunday, the pastor says that. And, uh, uh, I've always loved hearing that. All right. The Gospel, according to St. Mark, chapter 4, verses 21 through 25. And this one is entitled, A Lamp Under a Basket. And he said to them, Is a lamp brought in to be put under a basket, or under a bed, and not on a stand? For nothing is hidden except to be made manifest, nor is anything secret except to come to light. If anyone has ears to hear, let him hear. And he said to them, Pay attention to what you hear, with the measure you use, it will be measured to you, and still more will be added to you. For to the one who has, more will be given, and from the one who has not, even what he has will be taken away. And this is the word of the Lord this morning. All right, I'll go to the Pray Now app, and I'll read the prayer of the day. All right, let us pray. Almighty and gracious Lord, Pour out your Holy Spirit on your faithful people. Keep us steadfast in your grace and truth. Protect and deliver us in times of temptation. Defend us against all enemies. And grant to your church your saving peace. Through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. And amen. All right. Well, that was short and sweet this morning. Uh, I enjoyed doing this. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, so with that, be safe, be happy, 
and be blessed. We will see you tomorrow morning on Coffee and the Word. God bless.